nice having a space to walk. Safety, yeah. place to walk without worrying about traffic for this one. It's also just nice because people congregate there. It's just nice to walk by other people. It's also nice to see like kids running around and like the parents feeling like they can let their kids run around because the street is theirs. Day to day, very open street is pretty chill. You have a few people biking, a few people walking, you see people taking their carts to the grocery store. I see runners around here all the time. I see families enjoying the streets. I see cyclists like using it as like a way to safely travel. I am thrilled about Barry Open Street becoming permanent and us finally making this a safe street. It's because of the changes that we've been making on Barry Street that we're able to have our whole community out here to celebrate Halloween. Thank you guys so much for coming to the Barry Open Street today and happy Halloween. So the Barry Open Street started in the pandemic in 2020 and this is now three years later 2023 we have paint on the street we're going from broadway below the williamsburg bridge all the way up to mccarran park 8 a.m to 8 p.m people first you still have local traffic please drive five miles per hour and two-way cycle flow we are innovating on berry street with new designs to actually make it safe to slow down traffic to have loading zones for cars and trucks to be able to get in and out of the community, but to ensure that the space is primarily for pedestrians and cyclists and people to just enjoy it. One of the exciting features on the Barry Open Street is that um, the coral color that extends through is actually the first time coral has been used to paint a street in the five boroughs. We've reduced injuries from crashes by 71%. Things like this, the ball belt, Essentially, they shorten the distance that people have to cross the street. This is really critical because it helps people that are a little slower, it helps kids get across safely. It gives like an open spot for like community to like go outside, especially living in New York. It's like we have the parks and then other than that, like the street can be like a dangerous place for kids. So it's like redefining like this space. As a mom of four and living in Williamsburg, this is an amazing opportunity to have some open space for families to just bike in a safe place. Daylighting needs to be borough wide. It is so, so integral to safe streets and especially with all the public schools and daycares and Montessori's that we have in this neighborhood. The amount of space that we do have right now is such a small percentage to what we could have. It would be nice to have a proportion that really represents how people want to use the city. We've really done a lot of work to talk to people and to listen and to understand what could be best about this. The DOT worked really hard. I think I love it when, most when I hear someone say, oh, this is one of the people streets, and they know that they can safely walk around here and not have to worry about getting hit by a car.